So great. It, it is, it's so nice for you to have a new album out, I'm sure. It is. It's great. And it's how wonderful. many years was this in the making? Uh, it, uh, it's been three years or so since the last record, so yeah. You took a bit of your time. What, what was the inspiration oh. behind this one? Well, I, I have to say I've always taken my time between records. Yeah. And you got to sort of have a life in order to write about it. So um, the inspiration between, uh, behind this record, a um, lot of different things. Um, I, 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 fought, I had an illness about three years ago that was fairly serious. And um, from that, there's a lot of, I think, uh, songs that kind of address that. Um, and just the times we're living in, you know, um, songs about love and connection and uh, relationships in the world around us. Pretty, pretty, uh, pretty normal things to write about, I think. Yeah, but it's, it's all about miracles. What? So it's it's called, the miracles is the the age of miracles. The age of miracles. Um, so obviously that resonates for you and what you've been through as well. Well, I'm not saying that uh, what I went through had something to do with miracles, yeah. but rather um, the in the context of the lyric in the title song, yeah. uh, basically that um, you know if you. If you are, uh, if you that you live in an age of miracles, if you feel if you're lucky enough to believe in them, yeah. and um, but the the reality is that everything springs from within us. You know, we, we make our own joy and love and beauty, and the world around us can can inspire us. But it has to sort of start from within you. I agree. Visualization, my friend. I'm all about that. Absolutely. Absolutely. <laughs> Do you think country music has really had a a resurrection of sorts in the past year or so with Taylor, people like Taylor Swift, young country artists coming out. Do you think that? Uh, you know, I'm not sure that I'm completely on, uh, uh, you know, up to date with whether country music was experiencing a slide or not. But, yeah, people don't realize country music, you guys make a lot of money. There's, you, I mean, there's a lot. Country music has a huge following. Country music has always, um, made a lot of money in terms of like, like, I mean, you guys have huge followings out there. It's a niche, but you guys, there's a huge amount of people following. All well, I mean, you know, you're grateful for whatever audience yeah. might, might find you. Um, I think there've been some bre real breakout, breakout artists, artists past year. That, 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 that I think have gotten a lot of attention simply because they haven't, um, they, they've 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 been so successful and and have appealed to so many people that they're not uh, just relegated, if you will, or limited to yeah. one genre of music. And Taylor Swift, obviously, is a perfect example of that. She appeals to so many different kinds of music lovers. So yeah. And now you're starting a tour soon, or did, uh, where are you going to be going? Uh, we're going all over the United States, um, and hopefully, we'll be going to uh, the UK in the fall. And um, going back to lots of venues that we love and look forward to vi revisiting and playing in the summer is is particularly special because you're outside a lot and it just feels very festive and um, I, I can't wait. All right. Well, thank you so much for being with us sure. today. I really appreciate it. And congratulations on your new album. Right, so let's go shopping at Berkeley. I know. Come or Matt. You see, yeah, let's go there. Let's go ahead. I agree. I'm, I'm with you here. Or Mac, or the geeks would say, let's go to Apple. We have the two choices. I'd like to go to Apple, too. I'd be happy to go there. All right. Thank All right, you. thank you so nice much. To nice to meet you, Thanks. too.